Well, this area is Lancaster County and Bucks County. Um, you know, I think it's mixed. It's a little purplish. Um, you know, it's going to be really interesting here. You know, I guess, you know, these guys are trying to say, you know, who's more conservative than the last one, right? So whoever, you know, uh, is the most conservative in, in the public's eyes is going to come through today. Uh, and, you know, Pennsylvania is, is uh, you know, it, it's a mix. Um, and, you know, they have a blue, blue, blue governor here. And uh, it'll be really uh, interesting to see. I think it's going to be very close tonight. Um, you know, 38% of the money for these races uh, have come from out. Only 38% is from the state of Pennsylvania. And most of the money's come from, I guess, New York, California, Florida, and other places. Uh, tens and tens of millions of dollars have been spent. Um, and I guess Mehmet Oz has to, you know, let's see if he made the case that, you know, he can hold a conservative platform because I think people are dying for it. You know, Pennsylvania, there's a lot of towns here, you know, even Scranton, Biden's hometown, Allentown, all these places that were very depressed for a long time and they did really well under the Trump economy or at least better. And, uh, you know, Western Pennsylvania did really good under under Trump and the Eastern Ohio, Western Pennsylvania with the frackers, the boilermakers, the Reagan Blue Dog Democrats, you know, he did really well, even though he lost Allegheny County, he got counties around there. Um, so, you know, I, I think uh, key counties here are, are going to be, you know, let's say Latrobe, uh, let's say uh, Montgomery County, um, you know, outside of the Pittsburgh area, which tend to be red. I think Montgomery County had the highest votes for Trump uh, per capita, uh, you know, by a wide margin. Um, so, you know, um, it'll be really interesting to see, you know, uh, Kathy Barnett's made a I guess the last minute bull run, she got an injection of money. She only spent about 150000 up until today, uh, you know, up until a few weeks ago. And then she got $2 million from the Club for Growth and Pro-Life groups. Um, you know, listen, McCormick's claiming he's a conservative. Ted Cruz is out campaigning for him on Friday. Uh, Mehmet Oz has the full backing of the Trump team. And, uh, you know, Kathy is more of, uh, you know, an independent body. She said that she might not support any of the candidates if she loses tonight. Uh, which was interesting. Uh, she also said Trump is not God. So, uh, you know, she's taking kind of an independent route here. Um, it'll be really interesting. I think it's going to be very close.